How's it going, everybody? Well, we're just gonna hang out. I'm gonna drop some lures really quick. And uh, looks like I need to buy some more. And then we're gonna do some evolutions. Just hang out, do some power ups, see what uh, spawns from these uh, poke stops. Maybe we can get something cool on camera here. I'm gonna go plus a lot of these too. Okay, and I'm gonna look through my Pokemon suit we have going on because I haven't checked them since my last evolution video. So, uh, actually, I did transfer a couple, but let's see what we have here. But before we do that, I wanna power up my uh, Amphros really quick. Let's do it one time. All right. All right, nothing good spawning yet. All right, so let's go check out Pokemon. I was looking at my Alakazam with Confusion and Future Sight, and I powered him up a couple of times off camera. He is um, very strong. That's for sure. Espeon is good. I think he's stronger. So with this move set, same as Espeon. 360, that's a nice number. So, uh, I forgot about this. Uh, Weeping Bell, 95%. We have Acid and Seed Bomb. I want Razor Leaf or, yeah, Razor Leaf or Solar Beam, something like that. So, uh, before we start, I'm going to probably try on a Lucky Egg and then hit these stops. And we will start doing a few evolutions. Um, okay, yeah, so let's go ahead and do that weeping bell now. I hit those stops after. There's just people, like, staring at me. Like, literally, they're just, like, uh, standing outside of my car, staring at me. So, I was just kind of, like, looking at them. All right, so let's go ahead and evolve this. Yeah, I'm in my car right now. Yeah, I didn't try on the lucky egg, did I? <laughs> Got distracted. Let's go. Charge move grass. Okay. It's got acid. But, uh, yeah. <laughs> what did it turn out being? 1863. Okay, that's not bad. We go take this gym out. This is a clean gym. And boring. All right, so should we just try to catch these? Yeah, why not? Let the go plus get the rat tat. I'll go for this. One hundred, man. I, you can find some pretty high CP of those right there. I've gotten a uh, one thousand twenty-six CP one, so pretty intense. We evolved a thousand one. It turned out being a twenty-two hundred something. I'm going to transfer that. It's pretty low. Oh, look at that, pseudo Udo. Oh! I was gonna make this a live stream, but then I was thinking, no. Nah, I'll just record it, then upload it. And I just know I'm not too big of a fan of live streams. I know you guys like them and all, but 
Man, he's just trying to make a home run over here. Yeah, look at this guy. Oh, that was a horrible throw. Just wasting ultra balls, huh? It's all good. I dump them like crazy. That's why I don't really care if I uh, do that. Counter Stone Edge. All right. May not be great. Yeah. And there's a Jinx. Yeah. Common here. <laughs> oh, but a lot of people ask, how do you get so many Jinx candies? Or they'll say yeah, you're hacking because I have all the Jinx candies. And now I'm not. I'm not hacking. This is just like the biome here is ice, so get a lot of Jinx. <laughs> Like I've caught in one hound, hound do, hound doer, <laughs> one. So yeah, you can tell. I know people in California have like massive amounts of hound dunes. All right, so let's go ahead and see if there's anything cool we can do here. Oh, Go plus is going off. Let's see what we have. I don't want to push it. You know, it might. Might get that Tyranitar chance. You never know. Or eye horns. <laughs> Using the berries because either way, once I, my bag gets full, I'm just going to be tossing them. So somebody said, Why did you use a uh, pineapple berry on a suckle? <laughs> a suckle. <laughs> a suckle. A sh <laughs> shuckle. I, I, you know, why not? I was gonna toss them in. Man, what's up with these guys? I need to start using the banana, huh? Because I'm gonna toss the berries anyway, so I, you know. To be honest, in that video, when I used a pineapple berry on a shuckle, I was about to call it a suckle again. On a shuckle, um, I just did it just because. <laughs> it wasn't because I wanted more candies, I just kinda. Wanted to uh, use up. I like using up the berries, but without throwing them away. You know what I mean. So, nobody, don't don't trip out, okay, guys. I just I just wanted to use the berry on on the shuckle. <laughs> All right. Anyways, <laughs> suckle. <laughs> Go plus. These Pokestops should be changing any second now. Look like a cowboy or a Freddy Cougar. <laughs> Go plus. I should probably max out my slow king, to be honest. It's 100%. So. Yeah, I think this video will be the duration of these lures here, so. I'm going to check out my items, see what I need to... Alright. That's my evolution items. Like, <laughs> Actually, I should probably do one right now, huh? Let's see what we have. You know, this is what I'm thinking, guys. You know, I could have do a whole lot of item, evolution items, all that, but I want to kind of wait till the new Pokemon come out, the new gens, because they keep, they'll keep uh, giving them new movesets. So if I use all of them now, you know, when it, when the new move sets come out, I'll have nothing. So it would be the point. That's why I'm not just evolving a whole bunch, except for uh, Blossom. I could do that because I've got eight Sunstones on top of having like eight or so of them already. And we didn't talk about this Executor that I got, Palm. Uh, extra Sensory and Seed Bomb. That's a good defense moveset. It says Solar Beam. Yes, Solar Beam is good, but uh, personally, battling gyms every single day, I know a little, you know, you know what's pretty good to defend. And I'm going to tell you this. It's the, the moves that have more than one attack. All right, Go Plus is going off. We'll go back to him. Pidgey, Kabuto. All right. Nothing special. All right. Okay, so 
that's a good defense move set. Seed bomb. Um, I'm really tempted to power him up. I, I don't know what his uh, set is. His like um, IVs all the way. I'll have to check because I do want that powered up. Because like I said, those double moves for the gyms are what you want to put in there. Let me give you a prime example. Okay, guys, here. It's plain as day here. Let's go to Golem. And, you know, it's a shame we can't see the wins. And somebody asked, how do you get wins on your Pokemon? Because when I, you know, when I do the gym battles and then I show the Pokemon that I put in, it has sometimes a win. That's just, I'm pretty sure that's when a trainer is battling the gym and their last Pokemon, it just gets defeated by that one, yours, and then you get that win. So anyway, Dino Rock, 2658 CP, okay? Mud Slap, Ancient Power. Ancient Power deals 70 damage. Mud Slap does 15. And a lot of people say, oh, yeah, Ancient Power is not that great. Eh, it is good. You guys just don't understand. Some of you, a lot of you know. But this guy right here, or this uh, this girl here, <laughs> has uh, three wins. Okay, 26 CP. All right, as opposed to Dino Stone. Not bad. Great move set. Mud Slap, Stone Edge for 100, but you have one attack. It's one attack. You can get ready and dodge it. Stone Edge is quite the aggressive, you know, surprise. Even I have trouble dodging it because I'm just attacking and then all of a sudden it's just BAM! You don't even get that time window. So, what my point is, Pokemon that have more than one attack for their charge move are better for defense um, because... It continuously comes and it continuously just keeps getting them. Bam, bam, bam. So, and he has zero wins. So, and he's 2861. So, just gives you an idea there. Um, and if we go up to these victory bells, so this right here is probably the best moveset for victory bell, period. For now, period. Okay? Razor Leaf and Razor Blade because, I mean, three attacks and. The three is for 70 damage. That's good. And then as opposed to pretend that that was a razor leaf as well, okay? Um, hold on, wait. What am I saying here? Yeah, razor leaf for his first move. Say he had two grass moves and then solar beam, 180. That's really good, but the thing is he's only going to do it once. Um, even with the splash damage, he's probably going to wreck something uh, really nicely, even almost half health, depending on the CP of Pokemon you're using and or the type uh but yeah you're gonna want the double move so don't think that d if you're trying to evolve one and you get the double move one you're like no it it's still good um maybe not so much for attacking because they have two different purposes one for defense and one for offense so you know you guys understand it's just breaking it down for some people uh who don't quite understand that yet Go plus all that. Okay. Um. Oh, something just popped up. Rat attack. Gotta keep checking. Oh uh, man, since I'm recording and I don't want to miss anything great here. Somebody told me to power up my rock throw and stone edge, and I completely agree with you on that. I'm going to not go below a million Stardust. Uh, that's down my new threshold. I've said that before. but And I'm going to save some more Stardust because I do want to power up a few more things. Somebody also told me to power up Slowbro with Water Gun and Water Pulse. I will not regret it. And I agree with you, but for now I'm not going to. Just I'm just going to keep this. Um, something else pop? Nope. All right, so... Yeah, foul losing the gym. All right, representing Muck. <laughs> I did have this seal. I wanted to evolve with you guys. I've been waiting. I don't think it's even great. Yeah, it's not, but that's all right. We'll still do it anyhow.
15. Frost Breath Blizzard. Oh, man, that's pretty, pretty good. Pretty, pretty, pretty good. <laughs> uh, for the uh, more, you know, grown up audiences, if you guys watch Curb Your Enthusiasm, that's what that's from. Larry David. <laughs> All right. Uh, let's see here. Strong. Oh, I just pushed the go plus. No, 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 no. Ah, it ran away. Man, we gotta go check that in a minute. Oh, there they go. Right after this, we go look. All right, that's a very good move set. Rhyhorn, Sparrow. Hmm. Let's check what ran away from us. Uh, an Omnite. All right, that's fine. So I have to go plus is like in the uh, mic there, vibrating all loud. <laughs> all right. <clears throat> Let's see. One of these oddish is actually simply amazing. Let's go ahead and lucky I've been on. All right, excellent. Excellent. Another um, blossom. I don't know if I should just make a vial bloom. I, <clears throat> Ooh -wee, I need to drink some water here. I don't want to, uh, I want to make a blossom because, you know, I want to use up these items because I definitely do not want to throw away an evolution item because uh, they're starting to stack up and it's almost starting to look like I might be having to toss them. But I do not want to toss them. So we have Acid Petal Blizzard. That's a good indication that I might get a grass move for my first attack. Not so much so for my second. So let's go ahead and evolve Gloom here. Make a move around. Do a little, do a little of that. Let's go. Ah, water. Just like the plants need it. We all need it. Everything needs it. It stayed acid, huh? Hmm. Hmm. Yeah, pretty random. Pretty, pretty, pretty random. <laughs> all right. <laughs> uh, I just want to trade off my blossoms. Come on, you guys want some blossoms? I got, I got these blossoms, man. <laughs> Down the alley with the trench coat. Hey, hey, want that bloss? <sighs> Alrighty. <laughs> Let's see how the eggs. Oh no. Get in that incubator. Get in there. Geodude attack. Go plus. We'll go plus that and catch this. Gotcha. And everything else is going to get real plus. All right. And let us continue. <clears throat> Dang, let's go plus. I can't put it anywhere. It just keeps vibrating so loud. All right. Um, check this out. Look at vile plumes. See, that's the female. You see the top there? And now this is the male. Personally, like the female one, looks really cool. When you find these things in the wild, that's really neat because of the, you can only see the top of them, basically. <laughs> All right, Venonat, can we evolve you? No. Oh. Oh. Diglett. Diglett. Oh. Let's go, Diglett. Huh. 
when the Aloha ones come to the game. <laughs> the Doug Trio with the Aloha form Doug Trio has the hair. Hilarious. Um, if you guys are still wondering, if, if you even know about that, if you're wondering why, why do they even do that, is because um, I think it's somewhere around the volcanoes, some sort of metal fibers collect. Of some sort. Uh, you're gonna have to look it up to get the exact, you know, reasoning here. But something to do with metal fibers around a volcano that are natural forming, and uh, they look kind of like hair. So that's what they where they got the idea for the Aloha from the Geo. Hilarious. Looks like the Beatles almost. <laughs> the band. Um. Come on, spawn should be happening any second now. Let's wait, maybe a second more here. All right, well, let's, let's not wait. Let's go ahead and continue on. Oh, there they go. Go Plus is going off. Where are they at? It, it literally tells you by 15 seconds before they actually spawn. Sometimes even more. Put some more incense back on. There they go. And we'll go plus those. And we'll check out what we have going on over here. What? What's up with this thing? Come on now. <laughs> All right. All right. So look at all these ghastlies. They're all prepared to get evolved. But like I said, this move set that they move pool that they have going on right now, I'm not too. I'm not a fan of that for the Gengar. And what am I talking about? Let's see. It's dot, dot, dot. There he is. This is a very high of IV Gengar here, I think. That's the secondary move is great. You know, that's, you know, real, very good. But the, I don't like Hex. I mean, it's just me. I'm sorry. You know, don't, don't hate me for that. All right. Uh, let's go ahead and transfer this. 93 onyx i have four metal coats huh should we make another onyx guys i don't know maybe i should start saving my candies because i'm starting to get a little carried away with those onyx let's transfer this a little crabby a little crabby and palm palm i guys I'm just so hesitant to spend Stardust. It's just like, <laughs> get so nervous collecting it for so long. You know, that's the point of spending it, but there's so much more to come, you know? You gotta pace yourself. When I see not all the moves and attack power on some of the moves were even changed, it's very off-putting that spend Stardust. <laughs> you know, like, if I spend Stardust on a Pokemon, more than likely I'm gonna go all the way with it. So it's very troubling to know that Niantic can possibly nerf, let's say, let's let's go for, you know, the primal example. The primal example uh, of what I'm talking about here, uh, Psycho Cut. Uh, that was a good move, and then they all of a sudden cut it down like somebody who has their knees locked standing up, and then somebody comes up and like just eh, right in the back of their leg, and then... Since their knees are locked, they just kind of tumble down to the ground. That's what they did to everybody who powered up all their sweet Pokemon with good IVs and a good moveset that we finally caught. Say we did it like, you know, seven, six times to finally catch this, you know, get this Pokemon. And then what do they do? They go and tear them all apart. So that's the troubling part of investing Stardust. So if you're wondering to yourself, why is this guy, he doesn't spend that much Stardust. I, I, you know, uh... All these Pokemon that I powered up here is like probably over 5 million Stardust. Easy. Uh, so I do power up Pokemon. It's just lately, after seeing that whole change, is, you know, nerve wracking. So uh, let's say, for instance, uh, what it was Gen 2 and I powered up. You know, I don't care if they bliss it. Uh, I don't care if they bliss Niffy. I was liter literally going to say, I don't care if they bliss Niffy. If they, ner if they nerf Blissey. Um, and anyway, I don't care. Uh, I already know it's just going to always remain it somewhat of a tank. I don't care if they nerf the moves, uh, whatever. 
But uh, let's see if they like cut like here we go. Perfect example. Like say when the new Pokemon come out and we can get new moves for all the older ones. For instance, this one here uh, is the best set you can have from a chop period period. Yes, uh, di or um, close combat is good too, but it, it's what a hundred. This one's like ten less, or was it a hundred and ten? And either way, dynamic punch is what you want. So if the new moves come out, I powered him up. You know, I I, I evolved a few. I didn't get the move I wanted. And I finally got it, or maybe I only it only took one try. Nonetheless, I powered it up. I spent five or two hundred fifty thousand Stardust or something like that. And say if the new moves come out with a new Pokemon and then counter is at 12 and they, they're like, it's six now. And dynamic punch is a 50, you know, and then they make the old sets good or, you know, so spending Stardust to me is and not too good right now. So we'll just wait. Um, long explanation. You're like, man, this guy's just like crazy. <laughs> uh, so... You know, I'm pretty sure a lot of you understand exactly where I'm coming from because, uh, yeah. Anyway, long explanation there. <laughs> uh, let's see. You know, it'd be a good power up. It would be da, 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 that one there, but uh, Rock Smash Close Combat. Uh, let's see. I hope he's simply amazing. I better plug my phone in. Strong. Okay. Yep. Very good. Very good. Yeah, I'm gonna plug my phone in. My voice might sound a little bit further, but uh, I'm still here with you. Um. Ooh, we can transfer some of these. That's for sure. And then we'll see what spawn. Just a second here. Look at the CP on those bad, bad ones right there. Woo! Oh, okay. Wait. Alrighty. So. Cool. Alright. It's going off again. I, I'm pretty sure I should go check that. Uh, Transfer this horse. Ah, oh, shuckle. Yeah. Or should I say a suckle? <laughs> Oh, no, we're already recording. We're good to go. Right on his head. Bam! Kobe! <laughs> May not be great. That's okay. The point? No point. Max one out. I mean, I don't know. Let's see what will happen there. <laughs> Alright, let's get these stops. Pokeball, 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 Potion. Going I'd be inside, but the GPS is horrifyingly bad. Okay. Bonita? Oh, wow, 191 candies? You guys, should I evolve my Pony of Death? I wonder if I should evolve that. Because uh, that's a maximum OCP. Whoa, okay, I need to move that up. There we go. Decent. I don't think I should evolve it. I, I think I should just keep it a pony of death like that. Alright, so we'll just do this. Bonita! <laughs> uh, let's go. Alright, what did we get? Blow kick and fire blast. Okay. Okay. Go kick something. Fla or <laughs> Flareon. Rapid Dash. Anything spawn good? No, nothing spawn. 
Anything good on the map? No. Pseudo-Udo. Oh, no! You know what that means. It's the time to go. Unfortunately. <laughs> Alright, guys. It's actually been pretty fun. Um, let's... We didn't get down to Gen 2, really, so I'm gonna... Move this thing here. Let's kind of go down here, because... He's yapping a lot. Didn't really get down to some evolutions. Uh, 1,000. Uh, I mean, it has no harm, no foul. I mean, just evolve it. It may not be great. Whatever. Let's go. And so this is going to be a decently long video. Huh. Mud shot, hydro pump. That's very good, actually. Uh, let's transfer these, 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 and all of that. And something spawned. Uh, oh, never mind. <laughs> Kabuto. Let's make one, maybe. I don't think I have that many candies. Oh, never mind. Can we find a good one? Strong. Cool. Let's go ahead and do that. Uh, Stone Edge, and uh, actually, I I just caught one, and they had a they had a new move set. So let's see what, what we get. Not on this video, but okay. Rocks, Mass, Stone Edge. All right, that works. Let's get rid of some of these kind of uh kind of clutter. -y. All right, let's look at my Aerodactyls. Aero Steel, Steel Wing, Iron Head. All right, we're not gonna steal. Iron Head, Steel Wing, K, yeah. Steel Wing, Ancient Power. Steel Wing, Hyper Beam. Steel Wing, Ancient Power. Steel Wing, I Iron Head. Steel Wing, Hyper Beam. Steel Wing, Ancient Power. Bite Hyper Beam, that's the one. 420, one. All right, so let's go on down. We got Fupa King, unfortunately, doesn't have very good IVs. Because that, I, pre, I, that, this, Zen Headbud, you always want, to, you would always want that. Lick is good, they changed it, it's actually pretty good too. I powered my Lick Body Slam one, but Zen Headbud Heavy Slam, I would, oh, it's, I would so max this out if it had at least in the 90 IVs, I would just go up to town on it. But, uh, unfortunately, eh. So this is the one I maxed out. <clears throat> Lick Body Slam. And uh, Zen Head. I, I don't want to. <clears throat> I want a, a complete. For sure. Like a double move or a triple move for it. Because. That's what you want for Snorlax to power up. Anyway. Let's keep moving. Anything good down here to do. There's plenty to do. There's plenty of little evolutions. But um. So we got nine. Blossom, okay. <laughs> uh huh. Pseudo Woodos. Those can be used to prestige, but I'm gonna get rid of them because it, I'm starting to start up too many Pokemon. And uh, it's just starting to like losing control of what's good and what's bad here. <laughs> People in California are like, yeah, the pier, the pier. And I'm over here at my mall like, yeah, the three hookah stops. Yeah, that's what's up. All right, so <laughs> we're going to go and finish up the bottom of Gen 2. Right down here. Bolly Toad. No need to power those up yet until gym rework happens. And we see what's really going on here. What? Energy ball. That's right. <laughs> More like energy. Ho ho. All right. Anyway, let's keep it moving. Um. Hmm. Yeah, there's not. Oh wait, wait, wait. 
we'll, we'll go ahead and do this. This is such a worthy Pokemon to power up. Seriously. Defense. Defensively great. Offensive. Defensive. It's it's rounded. It's so good in Pokemon Go. Uh, let's take him up. Oh, wait. Is it him? Yeah, let's take him up. Should we bring it to 19? Probably. Ooh, it's going up by 15. That's a real killer there. Seeing 7,000 Stardust go for 15 points. Ooh. <laughs> okay. So we'll keep on moving it along. Nice. Uh, nothing else we need to power up down here because they're all maxed out already, basically. And I do have to tell you guys this, okay? This guy right here beat a Blissey. Well, he almost beat a Blissey. It was like, you know, had, the Blissey had a sliver of health left. And it was my fault. I was being lazy. And I did my uh, charge move, Hyper Beam. And I knew it was going to do his. And that's the only reason why it beat me. But let me see. Simply amazing. HP. Okay. I think that's like an 80 something. Um, so just to let you guys know, counter hyper beam is a blissy killer for Teddy Ursa. Or yes. Ursa ring, should I say. Sorry, call on Teddy Ursa. Um so I highly recommend that you uh or should I say I should have powered up a close combat. I didn't test that out. Is, is that a good... I could imagine if you had a counter close combat Ur Ursa Ring, that would just completely wreck a Blissey. Oh, man. Holy cow, I've just realized this. Wow. Okay, so counter and hyper beam work good, but could you imagine... What is that, 150? Okay. Could you imagine uh, the other one, close combat? It's only 100, but... Super effective, it probably will even out just as much as the uh, Hyper Beam. Actually, Hyper Beam gets stabbed, so you want that. So, wow, I keep going in a circle. Sorry, guys. <laughs> um, oh, I just can't spend my Stardust. I can't. It's like, there's like this thing on the back of me. It's saying, hey, don't you do it. If you do it, you know what will happen. Because I'll just change the Pokemon when the update comes out. And all the moves will be horrible. Well, it's not true. We'll see. <laughs> Slugma, huh? Should we just evolve one just because we can? Why not? This video is way too long. I should have dropped some more lures. Um, I guess we'll evolve one more Pokemon here. And I think I'll call it quits on, on this for now. And I'll catch you guys in a little bit. If I would have known I was going to extend it so long, I would have um, put it up some more lures here. But uh, I just keep getting people walking by, like, staring at me. <laughs> Which I don't mind. It's just like, hello. Yes, I'm, I'm on my phone talking in my car, you know. <laughs> Alrighty, anyway. Uh, since I tragically um, got Fire Blast on my second one, I should probably power up my Tyranitar. Isn't that going to be cool right now? Uh, let's see if this is even. Simply amazing attack. What? Wait a minute. Maybe not. Maybe I got to wait. See what the IVs are on that. Alright guys, and with that, I think we'll call it good. So thank you for watching, and it's just been a chill video. Just a chill. Pretty, pretty, pretty chill video. <laughs> so I'll catch you guys later. Thanks for watching.